What's up everyone? The Last Jedi teaser is here and we are going to break it down. This is so awesome, we have to take a look at it. The trailer opens to us with Rey on Octu. She's clearly out of breath, but at the same time she appears very alert. The next thing we hear is Luke say, Breathe. Breathe. And then it gives us a water view of Octu. Rey's Jedi training will be done on Octu, and the sun is setting in the shot of Octu, which suggests light and the light side of the Force. Luke says again, and breathe, breathe. Just, just breathe, breathe. When we are shown Rey looking out into the water on Octu, with the raging water. The shot isn't light like the first shot of Octu, which will suggest Rey's about to be challenged. The next thing we hear is Luke saying, now, now. Reach, out. reach out, and we see Rey's hand on the ground moving the small pieces of rock. This is part of the footage that Disney showed at their annual shareholders meeting, and this was some of the first footage ever screened of The Last Jedi. Next, the screen goes black, and we hear Luke say, What do, what you, do see? you see? The trailer then cuts to a shot of Leia, and as it zooms in onto her, we hear a whisper like we heard during Rey's Force vision from The Force Awakens. The whisper is Leia, and it's her saying, Help me, Obi-Wan, Obi -Wan. from A New Hope. This would continue to suggest that Obi-Wan is going to reappear as a voice in The Last Jedi, just like he did during Rey's vision in The Force Awakens. Next, Rey answers Luke and says, Light. Light. And then it cuts to Kylo Ren's mask, broken into pieces. This would advocate that Kylo Ren hasn't fully submerged himself in the dark side, and that there is still a chance that he could be redeemed in this trilogy at some point. Right before Rey says, Darkness, Darkness. we can hear Obi-Wan say, Seduced, Seduced by the dark, by the dark side, side of the Force, of the Force. voiced by Alec Guinness. Then the trailer shows us what looks like the Force Tree, but as Moses Garner pointed this out to me about the trailer, and that's that he said, At first, I thought that was the Force Tree we keep seeing on set, and after watching it again, is it the Bendu? Is that Force Tree actually the Bendu? Moses introduces a very, very cool idea here. When I was watching it at first, it looked like it was somewhere underground to me, but I do see where Moses is getting this Bendu idea from. Let both Moses and myself hear what you guys have to think about that in the comment section down below. Good catch, Moses. As we are seeing that, we hear Yoda repeat his line from The Force Awakens and Empire, surrounds, surrounds us, us and, binds and binds us, which also reintroduces Yoda to this film. Next we see a hand. I'm guessing Rey brush her hand across the symbol of the Jedi and say, The Balance. We hear a lightsaber ignite, and I've shown some more footage that was shown at Disney's annual shareholders meeting of Rey on Octu swinging the lightsaber, doing some fancy maneuvers with Luke watching. Next we see resistance fighters on Crate, which was actually mentioned in Rogue One, and if you want to learn more about that, I'll drop a card to click on screen now, and I'll give you guys a link to click at the end of this video. The resistance B-Wings are on Crate, which is the planet, heading towards the First Order's new walkers, which are called Heavy Assault Walkers. The next thing we see in the trailer is Finn in what looks like a medbay recovering from the injuries given to him by Kylo Ren during their fight in The Force Awakens. We are then shown Poe in BB-8 trying to escape to a ship that gets blown up. The explosion turns into a TIE Fighter being blown up with the Falcon outrunning two other TIE Fighters. I'm assuming Chewie is piloting the Falcon, but the question is, is he doing it with Rey and Luke, or is he flying solo? After that shot, we are shown a really awesome clip of Rey igniting her lightsaber and running. And based on the determined look on her face, I'm going to say she's running towards something and not running away from something. The only shot of Kylo Ren we see in this trailer comes next. We can clearly see the scar on his face from where Rey got him in The Force Awakens, and it looks like either Kylo Ren has Sith eyes now, that because they're yellow, or it's just his lightsaber reflecting in his face. Then Luke starts saying, I only, I only know, know one, one truth. truth. Then it shows him and R2 in front of a burning building, which I think is Luke's Jedi Temple where he was training his next generation Jedi. This shot mirrors the same type of visual that we saw when Luke put his hand on R2 during Rey's vision in The Force Awakens. Next is Phasma and her stormtroopers looking ridiculously awesome, walking through fire. And if I had to guess, I would say that this might be from the same scene where we saw Poe and BB-8 running as if they were trying to escape from something. Then we are shown a battle in space that's going on, and then it cuts to Luke saying, It's time, it's time for, the for the Jedi to end. To end. 
which could be hinting at Grey Jedi. That wraps things up for me here in this video. I hope you guys liked it. Let me know your thoughts down below on the trailer if you're excited for it, if you're more excited for the movie now than you were before. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this one. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace. Father, I have to. So you need.